each passing year, we find it more and more important to remember the life and the legacy of our good friend, Herb Klein. For decades, the San Diego Regional EDC has given out the Spirit of San Diego Award and the Herb Klein Civic Leadership Award to an individual who has gone above and beyond his or her job to make the community a better place for all San Diegans. And tonight's recipient, Conrad Prebis, is just the type of person who made Herb Klein so proud to call San Diego home. Through his countless contributions to healthcare, to higher education, to the sciences and the arts, Conrad Prebis is not only making the San Diego community stronger, he's making the world a better place. Higher education is about the promise of the future, and Conrad is an incredibly optimistic, forward-looking person. So there was a perfect match, really, between the good that he wants to do for our community and what higher education can bring to the table. And particularly at San Diego State, we are so excited because so many of our students have great promise and potential, but often it's a matter of giving them a little bit extra, a little bit of scholarship money so they can attend the university, or some extra support so they can participate fully in the university to have undergraduate research experiences, to study abroad. And these are the things that Conrad has been able to do at San Diego State, is really to lift up the experience of the whole university. And so we're incredibly grateful to him. Conrad has amazing interests, and he's touched almost all of San Diego. He has truly made San Diego a better place. Conrad's investment in the San Diego Zoo has allowed it to remain world famous being one of those zoos in the world that people want to see and want to repeat their visits. Conrad has allowed us to do it right. Conrad is generous. He's a happy person. He loves to share. And he looked at everything that he could from education to arts to healthcare. And I think that's what makes him such a special man. He gave a gift uh, several years ago to rebuild our trauma center and emergency room at Scripps Mercy Hospital. He gave the largest gift we've ever received, a $45 million gift to build the Scripps Prevost Cardiovascular Institute. Every day there are people going into those facilities and he's saving their lives. He is clearly interested in science, his recent gift to the Burnham Institute, for example. He's willing to invest in the future of healthcare so that it will, we will all benefit down the road. And I think he has great pride uh, that he's setting an example for others as well. He's an amazing man. I've, I feel very proud to know him.